Milner of uh, Milner Motors. That's right. And uh, you have two vehicles here at the uh, New York Auto Show. One of them is the flying car, and one of them is this electric car. That's right. Could you explain a little bit uh, how you got started with these ideas? Well, we've been uh, dreaming about making the flying car for a long time, and we sold our previous business and started working on this project about three years ago. Uh, started, we designed the flying car from scratch, started with a clean sheet of paper, worked with uh, an aircraft design firm to, uh, to validate our designs for how the vehicle will fly and uh, how the wings will fold. At the same time as we were developing that, we realized that a lot of the technology has applicability as an electric car also, and so we decided uh, about a year into the project to develop two vehicles, an electric car and a uh, flying car or a rotable aircraft. The electric car shares the same fuselage, so it's lightweight, aerodynamic. It runs uh, at 60 miles an hour on 6.5 horsepower because it's so lightweight and aerodynamic. We're anticipating getting 100 miles out of the charge. We'll plug it in at night and uh, charge it up. It also has an onboard gasoline generator uh, for it to extend the range. But most people's daily driving would be able to be done with, uh, on pure electric. What's the matter? We've been working on this for about three years. This is probably uh, another 12 to 18 months before we're selling this as a custom car or a kit car uh, uh, certification. The, uh, the airplane is probably two to three years before we're uh, with our prototyping. And what is the propulsion, si propulsion system for the, the uh, airplane? The airplane is going to be powered by two uh, rotary uh, aircraft engines spinning uh, ducted fans. So there's going to be two 30 inch ducted fans. Uh, the aircraft engines are probably going to be made by a company called uh, Rotomax in uh, Columbus, Ohio. And it will also have a small onboard gas engine for a front wheel drive on the ground. And as you can see, the wings fold up for driving on the road. And when the wings are folded, it's seven feet wide and seven feet high, so essentially the same height as a, as a Hummer H2. Um, wide, but it will fit in a parking spot. And the idea is that you drive to an airport, unfold the wings, fly to another airport, it will fly at uh, 200 miles an hour, and it will have about a 1,000 mile range in the air, uh, and then drive to your destination. For any trips less than 1,000 miles, it's going to be the fastest way from point A to point B, hands down. Faster than driving, faster than taking the airline. So it's really all about time saving. Our, our